From waves made of red rock to nude hot springs, the US has it all. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the top 10 truly interesting places in the US that belong on your post-pandemic travel list. And wait till you see the top three that we're going to be showing in this video. Something you would never probably have even thought of, so make sure you watch till the end. So without further ado, let's cut to the chase. At number 10, Travertine Hot Springs, California. Just north of Yosemite National Park is Bridgeport, California, the unassuming home of Travertine Hot Springs. The clothing optional springs are found at the end of a dirt road and surrounded by mineral coated red, orange, and green rocks. If you look hard, you can spot the Sierra Nevada in the distance. Best not to look down. Moving on at number 9, Crater Lake National Park, Oregon. Crater Lake, which was formed when a peak collapsed following a volcanic eruption 7,700 years ago, is the deepest lake in the US. The enormous body of water remains in a dormant volcano and reaches depths of 1,943 feet. Fed solely by rain and snow, it's so pristine some scientists have even called it the cleanest and clearest large body of water in the world. Next up, at number 8, it's The Wave, Arizona. You'll find this unique sandstone formation that looks like a red rock wave in Coyote Butts North within northern Arizona's Paria Canyon Vermilion Cliffs Wilderness. It's the sort of place you have to see at least once in your lifetime, and you'll need to plan ahead to make it happen. Half the daily permits are issued online four months in advance. Yes, four months! While the other half are available through an in-person lottery. Hence the phrase, I've got more chance of winning the lottery. At seven, it's Finger Lakes Region, New York. East Coast wine lovers don't need to travel to Napa when the wine-rich Finger Lakes region is just around a five-hour drive from some major cities like New York, Pittsburgh, Philadelphia, and Baltimore. One of the 11 Finger Lakes, Cuca Lake, is said to be where winemaking started in the region, and the Cuca Lake Wine Trail shows off that history alongside scenic lake views. When, if ever, you've had enough to drink, drop by the small village of Naples for some unusual wellness experiences cuddling with cows at Mountain Horse Farm, or enjoying some Japanese-style forest bathing at Finger Lakes Forest Immersion. Next up at number 6, Asheville, North Carolina. If you like beer and bikes, well, 50% isn't bad, make your way to Asheville, a super-hip southern mountain town that proudly houses the second-highest number of breweries per capita, beat only by Portland, Maine. The city is found off the Blue Ridge Parkway, a 469-mile scenic stretch popular with bikers do some biking, drink some beers, but definitely in that order. In at number 5, it's Washington, D.C. The 2020 U.S. election broke records, with an estimated 66.5% of eligible Americans turning out to vote. With political activism and democracy at an all-time high, now is the time to visit Ground Zero for all things political. Washington, D.C. The National Museum of American History named 2020 the Year of the Woman, launching several exhibits that remain up through 2021, while part hotel, part gallery Hotel Zena houses a mural of Roth Bader Ginsburg, made using, wait for it, 20,000 hand-painted tampons, as a nod to the late Supreme Court Justice's commitment to gender equality. At number four, Bonneville Salt Flats, Utah. A visit to Bonneville Salt Flats will trick your mind and spark your imagination. Once an ancient lake bottom, today the area is vast and flat and salty. Depending on the light and weather, the flats might look like they're underwater or appear to be a snow-covered lake bed in the middle of the desert. Stay hydrated, or you might imagine you've spotted a lush oasis in there too. Uh, mine's a beer, please. At number three, Martha, Texas. This desert town in West Texas may be small, it's home to around 1,800 people, but its art footprint is mighty. You can walk through giant outdoor art installations at the Chinati Foundation, which is situated in an old army base, or visit the Prada Marfa store, made famous by Beyonce. To potentially witness a paranormal phenomenon, head to the viewing platform outside town and watch for the Marfa lights, mysterious orbs of light that people have reported seeing since the 19th century. And then at number two, Crestone, Colorado. This high-altitude town sits at 7,923 feet and is home to several world religion centers and spiritual communities. There's a Hindu temple, a Zen center, Christian churches, and several Tibetan centers. People come to undergo a spiritual journey or transformation. 
or to soak in the nearby Valley View Hot Springs, a clothing optional nature sanctuary with six natural pools. Don't look down. And finally, at number one, Badlands National Park, South Dakota. The Dakotas often get overlooked as a tourist destination, and that's exactly why they're so wonderful. The dramatic rock formations of Badlands National Park might draw you in, but it's what's down below, if you'll pardon the expression, that's truly captivating. The park has one of the world's richest fossil beds. Think ancient horses and rhinos, and is the modern-day home of bison and bighorn sheep. You can get a feel for the park by driving the Badlands Loop Road before circling back to take on one of the park's many hikes. And there you have the top 10 truly interesting places in the US that belong on your post-pandemic travel list. Did you like what you saw? Let us know in the comments down below. Share this video with your travel type friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel TripExtreme for more fantastic top 10 lists. See you next time, travelers!